I was going to ask you, in effect, if it brought us right back to the beginning of our conversation. Were they, in fact, great, just great stars, or were they just part of an illusion? They were great. <laughs> they were great. I think that, uh, I think that uh, Keaton and Garbo, uh, my goodness, Cagney. I won't talk about Bogart because everybody does. I loved him very much, but I, I think we can get along without talking about Bogart for about three years, and his, his shade will be relieved. Yes. But Cagney, in my view, was maybe the greatest actor who ever appeared in front of the camera. Really? Yes. James Cagney? Yes. Why, why was that? What was this? What makes you First of all, he broke every rule about movie acting. He came, you see, the first thing that every stage actor says is, I learned to act with a camera because you have to do less. You can't, you know, you can't do laddie what you do at the National Theatre. You have to act for the camera and so on. Cagney came on as though we were playing to an audience of 4,500 people. He acted at the top of his bent, and he never hammed for one moment, thus proving my point that hamming is not overacting. It is false acting. It's fakery. Mm. And there's not a fake minute in a Cagney movie. Please have a season of him. Yeah, and study what, <laughs> yes, what he was. In fact, I was thinking the other day about the people I haven't interview, uh, interviewed who I'd love to, and I think he comes. He won't come. I know. Uh, he's he won't come. He won't. Complete come. recluse now, isn't he? Yes. Uh, well, no, but he won't come in front of a camera. No. He, he goes out and does his uh, his uh, thing, and he goes to Hollywood for six months every year. He sees his old cronies and so on. But in all his life, you know, he was like Tracy and a lot of people. He never went to a nightclub once. Never went out. You know, he was a totally uh, invisible. You know, Garbo wasn't the only one. Yeah. There was just a small group who went to Macambo and, uh, and slugged the, the photographers and did all that scene, you know. <laughs> <That was> a... <laughs> the rest of them were homebodies, you know.